tension on the rig. Okay. The, the forward safety bolt is out on the tabernacle on the hinge. Right. And now we're going to work on getting the strut pins out. Okay. Oh, we also lowered the boom. The boom needs to get pushed out a little more. Yeah. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, that. The turning blocks get fastened back because they are have about a, a quarter of an inch clearance once the mass oh, is down. Oh, once it lays down. Yes. Yeah. Okay, good and point. You, you yeah. will bind you'll, those you'll up. Bend, you'll bend them, yeah. Yep. Okay. Once they're out past 90 degrees, they'll make themselves a, you know, flatter. Yeah. I think I'll if, in case you forgot. But if they catch you. Yeah. We got the bolt out here. There we go. Okay, we're going to work on getting the pins out. Looks like we're getting pretty close to lowering it. Yeah, we are. It doesn't take long. There's no cotton pen holding those in. There is, but I just, we just shipped them in halfway because we knew they were going to be pulled out again. We didn't bend them. I can't get them. operation we're gonna have I'll run the winch and then you guys can manipulate the struts. Alright one other thing that needs to be done is because <clears throat> it's front end loaded with all the radars and stuff like that and you have to give it a little push. Okay. You have to you know one guy you guys can push it on put either push on the struts or the winch guy can yeah. push back on it. And then I'd really like to see nobody in the pinch zone standing up here yeah, watching right. the cable stay right. down. It's in case you have a blind part. Two guys, 
One guy can walk down and grab that one. Okay, so I'll go get yeah, that now. That one from resting. Here. This one. Yeah. Sounds it, good. It'll it'll stay on the spreader. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So just yeah. leave it yeah. there. Yeah. And yeah. don't don't grab it. Yeah. And uh, this way, this antenna is further aft and inboard than that one. That's why it catches there. Got so it. Got you it. have to be careful when you raise it. You don't want to get it to this point. No, you won't exactly. be able to get it in. Yeah. It'll get bound. You know what I mean? Okay. But you really yeah, want it to be done. Yeah. Right. And it's really best to you know make sure that you get all your your actions together because it's nice to just let it down instead of stopping it. Or bouncing on the cable. As you continue going down, will this eventually go well, past? You have to manually hold this now. Yeah, okay. So when you go up, it's critical to get, get it. it and stop right here so yeah. you can bring it inboard. Got it. Like, you know, otherwise you get fouled up in there. I can mm -hmm. see why it's better to roll that canvas back then. Yes. Yeah, instead of having those longitudinal slits, yeah. and, you know, yeah. it was only going to be problem. So you need to get up here and hold that. Walk it down. Okay. So we're gonna go out from yeah. here. Ready? Ready? Ready. 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 It was inadvertently left in the jammer. That's one of the things we need to finalize. Make sure that those things are free with lots of slack. So. Down there, I can squeeze it a bit. Uh, 